Hi guys, so this is a really fast video to explain you how to use the Creative Wedding uh, KV2025. It's a really simple plugin uh, that helps uh, a little bit with the grading. Uh, so I use it uh, as adjustment layer. So you can find it after that you install it uh, on the um, Creative Wedding. And then you see it here. It's enough to press uh, uh, option A and uh, you can get this adjustment layer or you can create an adjustment layer and then put it uh, over so when you click on it uh, you go into the inspector you have all this um, stuff so this video for example it was shot in S log 3 here you can find uh, the base uh, uh, the core actually of the um, plugin uh, that is this base uh, rec 709 or s log 3 or d log m d log or c log uh, 3 so if you shoot for example in uh, sony and you like uh, your conversation loot uh, it's enough that you apply the rec 709 if not uh, like me i'm shooting in s log 3 I put this one so it's enough to put the slider all on the top uh, and actually the the grade it's already good it's a um, it's a good starting point from there you can apply the other looks uh, that there are these so these are all looks uh, but if you apply them it creates a different kind of look on the image so this uh, these two they are the more um, soft and filmish they are really beautiful the N is the more natural it's a player a bit more deeper black uh, and it's the more natural uh, look the P is the um, um, the cooler one so it creates this kind of uh, blue in the in the shadow and it's really cool for internal, so for internal and for um, at cities, for example. I think that it, it should be really beautiful. Uh, here it creates this kind of look. That's also beautiful. And then the R and S, uh, they are the most, the more difficult. So these two, I would suggest every time a kind of 50% apply them. They are going to the magenta side uh, and um, they crash really easy the black. So I would suggest every time to use it at 50% uh, this and this. So this uh, has a, the most desaturated uh, loot. Uh, but every time if you stay around the 50% you get a, a good look from these two, the R and the S. And after you have here the, pos the possibility to have a really fast black and white. So you see, it's really nice because also here, if you apply the, the other look, it will change the look also of the black and white naturally. So um, here you have the possibility to have a before and after to see how it looks uh, the before and after. So this happened when I have different kind of uh, layer. I'm really chaotic in editing. Uh, so but normally you can see kind of before and after of the image and here above you have some some control stuff uh, the coolest is the the skin hue and saturation here you can control if you have uh, the skin that is going a little bit more in the green side or in the red side so it's really cool this is the saturation that is more density of the of the skin really good here you have a kind of saturation with this density so it makes the image a little bit more dense or a little bit less it does become black and white because for black and white we have this um, here we have some exposure control but uh, I suggest every time if you have to control the image uh, to control it in the clip um, 
I use every time Colo Finale for controlling the clip so as you can see here for example I control already the temperature of the image but from here you can have a really good control of the image because it's happening before that you apply all this plugin so I suggest every time to, to work in this way I hope you like it guys, uh, let me know how you find it uh, and if you have uh, some question just write me, let me know, ciao!